Okay. On that note, we cue the music. Let's do that. The cue is, watch carefully, five, four, three. You didn't say two or one. Oh, you, you don't say two or one. Why not? You just don't. Okay. Now, it goes... Five, four, three... Good. Okay. Good. All right. Uh, can we bring in the blue screen? Let's try one. And go. Okay. In five, four, three. Good, Terry. Uh, don't count along. We see your mouth moving again. In five, four, three. Guys, you're nodding. Once again, Terry. In five. Four, three, two. <laughs> Brought to you by Noah's Arcade. Um, yeah, Phil's got to do it. Co. Who's, uh, Phil should do this one. No, no, Phil should do the intro this time. No, you are the uh, the one who always messes it up. Yeah, yeah. That's every single time. No live shows. <laughs> every single <laughs> live show, every well, time. You are. You love SNL. So, what have you got to say? See ya. <laughs> yeah. That's the end of the show. Thank you for Bye. thank you for tuning in. That was good timing. Um, I know. I like you how we now have now. an audience. Oh, it's a really good audience. There would be no one. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. So, you're a big SNL fan. I'm a massive S uh, and M fan. So, what do you say? Live well, from- it is uh, live from Southampton. It's Saturday night! Yeah! <laughs> Yeah. So, uh, for the people who are in England who don't know what SNL is, that's Saturday Night Live, which is yeah, a TV yeah. show in America. So, live entertainment, which I love the most. But, um, yeah, so for anyone who hasn't heard us before, um, the dulcet tones you are hearing, we're dulcet. hearing right now. Dulcet. Dulcet. Dor- dulcet? Sorry, dorset tones. That's better. Um, was uh, Anthony, Hello. Mr. Anton Bain. Mr. Anton Bain. He is um, second in height, but. Uh, Number one in everyone's hearts. Yes. Yeah. You're damn right, and, Phil. Um, right. Who are you down the end there? You're Stefan down the end there. No, no, you're you. Oh, me. I'm, you. <laughs> I'm Monkey Man Phil. You are, Philip. Yeah. No, don't call me like that. Phil. Phileas, still the Nubius. That's. Don't give away my surname. What, Nubius? Yeah. Now he's going to get all of his arch villains <sighs> finding out, out of a pub. his loved ones and all those ex girlfriends yeah. of his that he wants to try and get away from. from. <laughs> we know, Phil, there's a, there's a lot of them. What? No one. I missed that. I actually did miss that. What was his name? You should listen. You all the mics, you need to listen. <laughs> Why has Phil got two mics? Are you holding a press conference? Yes. yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you sign it. You're, uh, that's going to fall off there. What? That one. Just right there. No, it's not. Yeah. And that one. All right. Good night. And um, <laughs> once again, uh, I'm Stefan, or Hi Stefanition, as I go by on Twitter. These are all our Twitter handles that we use um, as, in, as our introductions. Really? Yeah. yeah. We are mm. predominantly a video games podcast. We usually go on tangents of other things. A lot of Massive things. winding tangents uh, that make no sense or lead generally anywhere. or lead anywhere. What is that That's elephant true. doing? <laughs> that got another nose. elephant is oh, wearing red a red nose, nose. Red nose because yeah, yeah. we are <laughs> live from sunny Southampton. Yeah. Well, it probably would have been today. I don't know. And it was quite sunny. It was, quite it was sunny, a really nice it? day today. Yeah, yeah. And um, we are uh, for Comic Relief, part of Superpod. What's Comic Relief? Red Nose Day, isn't it? That's why we got the red isn't noses, oh, raising right. money for lots of red good causes. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, so why would you do too much cocaine? What a red nose or a balloon? Um, because the balloons generally, when it's being exported across <laughs> lines, isn't no, it? it's not. It's not blown up though, is it? It's. Um... <laughs> 
I couldn't whistle because I was smiling. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. Um, but no, we need to... Because we're now... Are we past nine o'clock? We're post- we have to swear. Yes. So we are now past the watershed. That doesn't mean you have to Post watershed. Um, we have decided that generally we are... Once uh, generally we're a uh, family friendly yeah, show, we do uh, edit any swearing out. Oh, you've got your change out yeah, ready. So we've ready. decided to incur, a impose fee. a fee, um, penalties for anyone who swears. There? What? Sorry, <laughs> just put my card in there. It's contactless. Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Phil's going to set up a direct debit. I might as well. Um, so yeah, any swearing. If we don't hear it. But if anybody in the in the massive crowd, everybody, Yay. wow! <laughs> and, um, wow! If they don't, thank if you, everyone. We miss the swears. <laughs> then it's uh, up to you guys to keep an eye on it. Um, and yeah, so we are predominantly a video game podcast. We go off on tangents, but geek culture and such, and holidays um, to Greece, holidays to Greece, goats cheese. Oh yes, me isn't it? Yeah, oh, we yeah. Were, yeah, yeah, and you were telling us about um, Gandhi. Oh, Gandhi, that guy, he's horrible. Oh. I didn't swear. No, but there we go. Oh. oh, I was close. Oh. oh, he was close. Oh, so close. <laughs> Only because in the, in the video game Civilization, he is the oh, most yeah. evil character of all, and he's supposed to be all about the peace. But so I get really funny about this guy. He's, it's One, a parody two, three, account. Four, five, it's six. like if you. Um, I can swear like seven Roy times. Cropper I can swear Twitter. seven times. I've counted. I can swear one and a half times. Shit. Three. <laughs> but we cannot use the C word. That is... It's Cock. S- Damn it. Well, I wouldn't have said that was a swear, but that's fair enough. Oh, I'll take it back. But because it's <laughs> a... money back from charity. I've done it before. <gasps> I'll do it again. <clears throat> I can swear. Because it's a Saturday it's night, um, our theme for the show, every uh, episode that we put out, the theme is a genre video games most of the time and we thought it's a saturday night i don't think we've recorded on saturday before i don't think we have no and yeah yeah that's true so we felt that the theme for a saturday night should be movies or rather games based on movies because generally they tend to be shit no i wasn't ready (laughs) i knew no i knew i was swearing but i wasn't ready with my money money that's a long way for me to reach i know i'm tall but you got to flip it in there. You, you are prepared. You got notes. Yeah, I got notes. You got paper money. I know this is going to happen. Phil is prepared to turn yeah. the air blue. <laughs> so, diaper money. gentlemen, as ever, we have been playing games. Yep. Games based on movies. Correct. What games? Who wants to go first with the game? Phil does. Phil playing? always wants to go first. What are we doing? All right. <laughs> All right. So I'm going first. Phil. Phil, go first. Hello. Hello. We're here. Hey, Phil. Hey. Oh, okay. So I'm going to start off with uh, I played Hulk to begin with on the PlayStation 2. Hulk? I played Hulk. Bet it sucked. Now, is that Ang Lee Hulk or is that um, uh, Fight Club guy Hulk? It's, no, that's it's, the same guy, isn't it? Ed Norton. Ed Norton. Was he? He was it's first Hulk. Hulk. Was he? Not Eric Banner. Eric Banner Eric. was first Hulk. Okay, that's Ang Lee well, Hulk. Was it Lou Frigno? Was he first? Oh, uh, well, okay. <laughs> Don't make him angry. No. You won't like him no. when he's angry. Now, would we like the game when it's angry, Phil? That's the question. Nope. It's a game? It's a game. <laughs> it's definitely a game. It's uh, a little bit dull in Is terms it? of uh, you just feel... As, right at the start, it's just so boring. Well... <laughs> so was the movie. <laughs> to be honest, every stage the of Ed it, Nor- apart so, from the boss, is a boring... What? Go on. Is it... It's Ed Norton Hulk, is it? <laughs> Did... Yeah... Which one was it? Oh, just a load of pixels on the screen. What what console was this on? PlayStation 2. Yeah, PlayStation 2. Right. Hulk. Just Hulk. Just Hulk. Just Hulk. Then I think it would have been... Is that the first one? Second one was Incredible Hulk. Second one's Incredible Hulk. Oh, wow, it's Ang Lee Hulk. <laughs> Jeez. I had to stop from swearing. I haven't got much change. <laughs> I would say I'd help you out, but I need all £17. Pounds worth, like. <laughs> <laughs> so what kind of a game is it? Terrible. Okay. Yeah, I gathered that. Phil, did you play the game? Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Are you on I, glue? I finished the game, but it was just. <laughs> what? Are, Are you, you on glue? Not right now. <laughs> <laughs> Were you when Do you, you mind played if I the game? Up? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> no, the uh, the game was 
linear, very, very linear. Um, just beat him up and just beating up. Yeah, it was just. Literally Sounds like the Mark constantly. Henry entrance song. Huh? Sounds like the Mark Henry entrance song. <laughs> I'd make him laugh on that one. The Mark Henry a very specific. <laughs> yeah, he has a very specific joke towards Phil. That was. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. But sexual no, chocolate. Was just, yes. Yes. <laughs> Mark Henry sexual chocolate. Yeah, yeah. Not that I, stage. You're talking about the new Mark Henry. The Hall of Pain, Mark Henry, not the it's sexual baby. Oh, that not that one. <laughs> not that one. The one afterwards. Come on, come on. The rest of it. I'm not going to do the song. No, no. Yeah, do the song. Which one? The song that you're talking about. What the the beat him up, break him down. Break his neck. Yeah, that's. I don't know. I just know that one. That like one part. Going. No, that's the, that's the only bit I know. Oh. So how can I do any more than that? Oh, yeah. yeah, bloody hell. See, Tell us about Hulk. This game you played. You said. Oh, I did play it. Oh, I was more interested in finding out <laughs> Ant's rendition of that's, various wrestling yeah, themes. Yeah, that's why I automatically, when I realised what was going on, I was going to start changing the subject <laughs> back to. <laughs> the whole oh, train. train. Oh, it's not a swear word. We can say that. It's a gardening. Implement. Yeah, exactly. That's what it is. It's like a rake. <laughs> right, okay, sorry, Phil. So, it's a beat em up, is it? It's a plot like linear beat em up where you have to do, say, <clears throat> start off with uh, <clears throat> running through a, like, a building. <laughs> <laughs> really wanting to pay all his money in. That's what I'm trying to make him really wind up. Are we just going to wind him up to the yeah, point yeah. where he's just he like, the where's Hulk. my checkbook? <laughs> yeah. He becomes the, the Hulk. Hulk. Yeah, yeah. And then. I pay all that money, all their monies. I might as well just put it in now, shouldn't I? Um, money, money, money! Yeah, it comes it's just the money. Linear, and you just find yourself just beating up random guys that are just the same pixel of the is same. That beating guy. up random guys or beating, beating off random, random guys? guys. Two. What's that? Was it being up or beating off random guys? A mix of both. <laughs> it's a Saturday night. Come on, it's Southampton. Because there's, 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 there's like big dogs that are like Hulk infused dogs. So you're kind of huh? beating them off. Yeah, there's dogs that. Like, <laughs> Beating them off. <laughs> yeah, you've got to beat off these dogs. Stop right. laughing. I've seen that movie. What? <laughs> what movie? That's terrifying. What movie? The dog movie. That Ant is. Um... The dog beating off movie. <laughs> Bloody hell. Oh, yeah, so you've got to we've... beat off these dogs and stop them from attacking you. And then we you're bossed at the end so of each, each chapter. And there's only six chapters. So it literally took me about two, three hours to finish. But it wasn't much fun. Okay. Yeah, but you played on easy. I did play on easy because I wanted to get through it so I could actually say I, I played it. You played on easy? I played on easy. Wow. So does the story follow the film I plot? I can't remember the film. There's a bit when he's on a jet? <laughs> no, I think it actually, no, I read it. It's after the film. So it's based after the film, apparently. Okay. But it wasn't that great. I hear the, the Incredible Hulk one is better. The, the, I hear it's like a GTA kind of you are the Hulk and you run around and smash things as Hulks do they do that at times at times yeah that's his, <laughs> like, that's his like catchphrase and stuff good input Phil shit <laughs> taxi for monkey man <laughs> okay well my game that I played I'm going to go next <laughs> you do that then. I'm going to. Um, see if you two can guess. It is possibly the worst one that I've ever played. Worst game ever played or worst movie tie-in game ever played? Ooh. Possibly both. Okay, okay. It is... The game is based on the film that started all of this. Started all of this? Matrix? I don't mean the hotel. <laughs> <laughs> what, as in... No, they didn't have a Wayne's World game. Did they? I'm nodding. Yes. Yes, oh. they did. On the Super Nintendo. That was a Wayne's World game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is going to cost me money. It is fucking dreadful. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad. Hi, Wayne. Was that in it? Yes. Yes. It's, okay. <laughs> it's the, wor the first thing. Was the gun rack bit in it? No. Because where would you keep... A gun rack. <laughs> yeah. Let alone Go. many guns that would necessitate a rack. Um, it, uh, it started... I thought it glitched. The music <laughs> is that bad. And it's... I couldn't even guess what the music was that they were playing, but then it, uh, it kind of changed, and it was actually the Wayne's World theme. Right. 
And it starts with Wayne and Garth on the sofa. And there's bad samples of them going, party on Wayne, party on Garth. And there, it's some story of... Is that the bad sample? Y- yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's worse than that. In 16-bit glory. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And they do the extreme close-up, and it's literally Whoa! just just their heads <laughs> just kind of going meh, 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 forwards, like, with no in-between animations. Like, the the, the, the cut and shut. Was that in it? The, the cut and shut. No, no, no. But that guy is... Oh, I love it. The vac and suck or whatever That's it, vac and suck. Yeah, yeah. Um, and... It's it, it was just it's so bad from the outset, and it's this weird story about how Wayne has been. Uh, Garth gets kidnapped, and Wayne has to go and rescue him. But it's in this weird kind of dimension, and Wayne has a massive head, and there is repeating samples as you play through. It's a platformer. Yeah, of course. Starts off in the music shop. And it will be mine. All Wayne oh, yes. says is it will be mine. Party on. Excellent. <laughs> swing swing is a power up. Swing's a power up. Yeah, you press it, 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 it goes swing and it's like a, a nuke takes out all the enemies on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> you go around, you've got an electric guitar that you fire, you play notes and you fire the like notes, notes at the enemies, and you pick up power ups that change the chords. And they're different, like, attacks. There's, like, a rapid fire and there's a widespread shot. I couldn't get past the first level. Whoa. When you Do die... You easy? Like no, dead. there's no difficulty. Uh. When you die, there's... Uh, Wayne drops to his knees and goes, Not worthy! Not <laughs> worthy! Yeah, when you've heard that the fifth, sixth, seventh time... Not funny! Not anymore. Not no. funny! Jeez, that... You want us to go party with you, Alice Cooper. <laughs> You're worthy! <laughs> it, but then, like, the next... I didn't play... Because uh, there's a level select cheat, so I found that out in order to try and see what the rest of the game had Up, in down, store down, right, A start, start, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And it was... Um, I skipped straight to the last level, but I watched the cutscenes, and it's basically two kind of static blocky figures of Wayne you can see it's Wayne and Garth and they're just and you've got this repeating theme tune there's like four songs in the game this repeating theme tune um, going over and over whilst you're watching these little text chats that they're having about the last level and the new level coming up and the last level is like the street so you've got the hockey posts and stuff and then you've got the guy with the suck cut game on going around um and it's it just doesn't make any sense but other people like um what's the girl's name hi wayne oh i know her um lara flynn boyle is a real name yeah yeah that's the um psycho hose beast (laughs) ah but whatever her she's like an enemy and you have to avoid her it's just it that's going to wind me up now. Terrible use of a license. Um, I mean, but I suppose sold a lot. I don't think it did. Really? I think it was by um, THQ. Oh wow, THQ! They make such great games. <laughs> but no, they don't. <laughs> I just they make amazing games. I honestly, I, I felt bad playing it. <laughs> it was making me angry. Especially as well, it's like our namesake. I know. Of all the things, that I know. Noah Vanderhoff was nowhere to be seen. Luckily, his name was not besmirched. Well, he's not even seen here, so he, he's never around. No. He's never around when we need him. He no. just keeps I heard us he's dead. I don't know. Well, we never heard back from. I hope he's not. We never heard back from the guy. Because <laughs> the the guy. Yeah, you know, you remember the Christmas episode, and yeah, yeah, we all decided that we were going to try and find the the guy, the actor who played the bloke who was. Brought to you by Noah's Arcade. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I found him, and I yeah. found him on Facebook. And, and I sent him a message, and I haven't heard anything. What a douchebag. Oh, that was close. <laughs> that I could hear close. it. I was really we're hoping you were going to make it rain. Make it rain. I have a feeling. But, um, yeah, I was really disappointed we didn't Stacey. hear from him. Stacy. Stacy is the, the name of the woman in it. I lost you once, Stacy. <laughs> Get the net. <laughs> 
but um, yeah so I thought I'll play the Wayne's World game it's a good idea I kind of wish I, ha- I, I wish I could have some sort of no surgery make another one what Wayne's World 2 yeah yeah, oh, but the film, the film didn't do very well, did it? The first film, uh, the first film did. It made like ninety-eight million or something. The second movie was like fifteen million. Well, the first film is uh, one of the most successful um, Saturday Night Live, Live movies. Isn't yes, it? yeah, it is. Yeah, because yeah. you had that. Like, Lorne Michaels is the executive producer, and it's the most profitable movie he's done, apart from one Andy Samberg movie. But can't which one is. I was watching a. Uh, it was like a ten facts that you probably didn't know about Wayne's World. Yeah. And Benjamin's character is actually based Rob off... Rob Lowe? Of, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is actually based off of Lorne Michaels. Really? So if you watch... A sleazy TV production. Yeah, yeah. Uh. <clears throat> So if you watch uh, this... Uh, you watch the Rob Lowe's performance, it, it, he was actually coached by Dana Carvey to... Who would have worked with him on SNL. Yeah. yeah. To actually act as... Lorne Michaels in uh, in Wayne's World. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Yeah. And um, speaking of Dana Carvey, he actually is a drummer, and that's when he plays the drums in that section. That's actually that's real. Yeah, yeah. No. He is actually a drummer, and that's actually real. That scene when the guy's like, "Whoa, you're awesome, dude." <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I like to play. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I'd like to get by I'd now. Like to get by now. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so Wayne's World, Super Nintendo, nineteen ninety four. Terrible game. Terrible game. So much so that it just cost me a pound. <laughs> it was well, it worth it. Did it cost you a pound, or the fact that you swore? The fact that I swore. You had to swear to to say how bad it was. Uh, I had to download a ROM because it's quite hard to get hold of. Oh, okay. I could have. I I did look. Um, to buy a physical copy for the Super Nintendo, but um, yeah, they're not cheap. the The bad games always seem always seem to be expensive. Yeah, I don't know why. No one them. Yeah, I suppose it's like the <laughs> ET ones oh, that, that came terrible. out on the, the Atari that all got dumped in a landfill, and then they dug them all up, and people were paying hundreds of dollars for and these movie out of it, dirty, they? dusty games. I've noticed that with like the real, real bad old games. People want to buy them to, to pretend See they like them they again. Are. It's like Red Dead Revolver. It's a terrible game, but like it's got five out of five on PlayStation Store. Is it? It doesn't make sense because it's an absolutely terrible game. It's not even Rockstar either. Probably, it was Capcom, but is it is Red Dead the predecessor to Revo- uh, yeah. Bessie Boy? Oh, sorry, I just got excited. <laughs> he thought we were going to say uh, Red Dead Red Thingy. <laughs> What's the new one that's coming out? Uh, Red Dead Redemption That's 2 yeah he thought we said Red Dead Redemption 2 and it got him over excited no that would be me he doesn't really care he, why are you about Red Dead Redemption do you actually oh, care about you Red Dead Redemption <laughs> <laughs> I bought it the other day but I haven't played it what Red Dead Redemption 2 no Red Dead Redemption I haven't played it whatever ever <laughs> for the audience at home <laughs> Anthony has turned his back to Phil <laughs> yes how have you never played it how have Probably you been my I friend for my almost 10 Phil, years but... and not played it because I didn't buy it. Is it because I literally always talked about it? I don't know. I probably ignored you when you were talking about it. Wow. I ignored you right now. <laughs> you know, I listen know. to everything Ant says. Do you? Yes. Cause... Just in case. <laughs> I try not to. In case it's libelous. <laughs> yeah. And I can hold him to ransom for it. That's why it's always fans always on record. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Ho, 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 ho. <laughs> literally checking his phone to make sure it's on record. No, I had a text message from a friend saying, good don't luck. Lie. Don't lie. You haven't got any friends. We're your friends. <laughs> Just shut up. People, <laughs> this is a new audience, and I was hoping to reinvent myself. As a different person. Standing in the middle of five guys wanting to eat my burger. <laughs> Just in the middle. Trying to... Standing in the middle of five guys, yeah. Trying to eat... <laughs> you start off. Eating burgers. Oh, my God. Yeah. Yeah, that... Uh, plug, plug, plug. Plug, plug. <laughs> Bought that one back. Hadn't heard that, like, some of the first yeah, ten episodes. Been, I think it's probably since we established that we didn't have an audience. Oh, we've got a few people. We bought the new equipment. Yes. Because we used to plug all the time. We did. I think we got plugged up ourselves. Plugged out. Money expecting me to swear at Yeah, then. I'm really annoyed that you haven't swore yet. No, no. You're fine. I don't want the bitches. I'm just seeing Churchill what as well. Make... I'm going to turn them around. What if we were to say that know? Budweiser is truly the king of beers? It well, is the king of beers. Swear. Fuck off. Yeah! Woo-woo! Bunch of shitting... Oh! 
I'm not going to say the level. You were going to say the C word. You were. Yeah, 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 I, I could hear it. I could hear it. That, he went straight to 10 on that. <laughs> <one>. <laughs> Just by saying he about Budweiser. straight to 11. He is tasty but, though, Phil. You know that, right? But this one goes to 11. Absolute douchebag, you piece of shit. For a five pound note, just for saying Budweiser. That's a magical floating fiver. <laughs> yeah, I need to put that in there because it doesn't want to be donated because it hasn't been. It's these new plastic notes. Yeah, they're weird. <laughs> okay, wrong. just me you then. Realise you can rub out the Queen's eye on them. <laughs> what? You can actually rub out the Queen's eye on them. Yes, but that's punishable. Oops. By um, who's going to find out? Well, anyone listening to this? <laughs> well, I have. They know where it. we are. I've just seen customers do it. All right. <gasps> I'm not going to name names. What are you doing? I was looking at your bowl cap. Oh, point. You thought I was going to sell it on Fallout. <laughs> You're welcome. So, uh, did you... Have you yes. been playing anything? Yeah, and it's actually probably the most... Let's see if it's on that list. No, 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 that's surprise oh, I'm not supposed to look at that. Don't so, look at that. Surprise list. So that's the game, my shopping list. <laughs> <laughs> See, my one is on Nintendo. It is a Nintendo game, so you probably were gonna, you're going to get this real quickly, Stefan, by the way. Um, it's probably the... You that. Yeah, I know, right? Ching, ching. Chang, chang. Don't know why I said chang, chang. Um, it's the most well-known movie tie-in game of all time, I'm going to say. It's a first-person shooter. It's based on Nintendo. It wasn't Ooh. a launch title. Is it Doom? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> James Bond. Is it... Be more specific. Tomorrow Phil. never dies. Of course, it's Golden Eye. You don't play that game. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Phil, what was, what was the score last time you played? Mm-hmm. What was that, Phil? Mm-hmm. What was that, Phil? I don't know. What was it again, Phil? I can't remember. How many times did I die in ten minutes? Uh, I zero? did. I didn't die. How many times did you die, Phil? Uh, zero. It was about thirty, wasn't it? Zero. I'm amazing. Like a three and a zero. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He got really annoyed because... Oh, we, really oh you were so annoyed. Right. Uh, we put it on license to kill mode, so it's one shot, one kill. And he got really, really annoyed because he then realised after about a minute that I knew every single spawn point after you died in order of, well, when, of when it happened. I, I like, think... Were you, playing, were you playing split screen? Yeah. I think somebody might have been peeking at somebody else's screen. He doesn't actually need to. He Don't actually need to. Time. Not on Goldeneye. Not on Facility, anyway. All I know is mm. I got really annoyed with the song going, GH just went, <laughs> and I'd go straight up to the toilets waiting for him to come out of the, the vent. Boom. So, right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Rewind. Then I'd go straight down. Hang on, hang on, the, hang on. What? Rewind. You're, you're just singing there. Yeah, yeah. You uh, went straight up to the toilets. Yes, I did. And you were waiting for Phil. I was waiting for the film in the toilets, yeah, yeah. And then you played Goldeneye? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, revelations here on uh, well, Superpod. Now we know. <laughs> now the secret is out, Phil. That's how I got my red nose. That's how you get your red nose? <laughs> <laughs> See, <Why? laughs> I think, didn't we have this discussion not so long ago? Because facility, apart from red noses, that's a separate oh, whole okay. other... There's a whole other situation. whole other kind of worms on. that we dare not open again. <laughs> Um, was it facility that I was saying about playing on and putting the proximity mines up on the yeah, yeah. TVs so that when people walked under No, that's not facility. That's um, the bunker. Is it bunker, is it? Yeah, yeah, because then as they walk past, the explosion would then no, take the, the TVs No, the explosion out. hurts them, yeah. but doesn't kill them. But, but the, the TVs TV. falling from the explosion do kill them. That's right. Yeah. That was that was my little trick. What about the game? Everybody was, loves was, playing GoldenEye with me. You, yeah. <laughs> so annoying. Yeah. Because I'm over the other side. They're checking my screen. I'm over there. They're in the uh, main comms room. Dead. Yeah. My favourite was when you put slaps only. Mm. It's, the, it's the sound effects from the slap. game. It's Mark slaps only. Yeah. It's slap. it is. <laughs> the sound effect was... It was... <laughs> <laughs> That's the sound I liked. <laughs> <laughs> and then you played Goldeneye. <laughs> I played Goldeneye. <laughs> um, uh-huh. Now, did you have a specific no odd job rule? I said odd job. Uh, paintball odd job mode. Paintball odd job mode. Or DK, DK mode. DK mode. DK mode. Odd job DK mode. That was basically just playing it normal. But yeah, odd job is never really allowed in that game because it's so unfair. Because he's he's not in the same height as everyone else. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. You, you do a normal like shot this way and you have to really look down. Yeah. Isn't that but right, Phil? Gold Knight is... I know what we're talking about. <laughs> Gold Knight is, has to be the king of the movie games oh I don't know I did play Disney's Lion King on the Mega Drive oh that game was amazing yeah that was the yeah. king now the Disney yeah, yeah I, I've heard we've got is it Jack yeah. we got Jack from uh, Nintendo Podcast System waiting in the uh, waiting in the wings for 
our eventual demise, um, <laughs> which is coming soon. Um, so you were a fan of? I definitely had that game. Yeah. The second level was a bit. Mm. Now I never really. Is that when you're jumping on all the giraffes? Monkeys, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I great soundtrack. <laughs> I never played Lion King, but I was a big fan of Aladdin. Yeah, yeah, I bet Aladdin. A B B A B B A B B A. Level select. Yeah. yeah. Um, Mega Drive. It's amazing. I, I do know about Lion King. There's a hacked version you can get, and if you try and use the level select on it, it takes you back to the second level again, which is the hardest one. Oh. oh. That's clever. Spammy. Yeah. yeah. Very good. <laughs> That's clever. Um. My favorite bit was the the audio because it's a cartridge based game, so obviously all the audio was was terrible when it comes to the voice. And there was a bit where Simba then falls down into the like, where all the fawns are after the elephant graveyard, and he had that one of the hyenas go, "Have you ever come back?" Long gap. We'll kill you. <laughs> and I was like, that was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> so a massive gap between the. It was uh, really samples. stupidly large really amount of time. Odd. Yeah, yeah. Um, but then you became adult Simba, so they can kick ass, and it wasn't just. Um, just meowing slightly and then trying to kill butterflies it was actually trying to kill bigger creatures like See, bigger butterflies now I'd, ne- <laughs> I'd never really played it but I did listen to I was trying to find some inspiration for uh, sound effects roulette that we've got coming up shortly hopefully if Phil's phone's got enough charge in it to, hopefully hopefully yes. um, and I was going through the soundtracks to Lion King uh, at the Mega Drive and the SNES version and it's the difference between the two systems in their terms of their quality of sound was it's the the gap is it's actually quite surprising because they're both basically this the same power but the snes's sound was just so much better than isn't it because the mega drive was mono and the snes was stereo well there is that yeah cause, but I mean the Mega Drive 2 was guys stereo. Over here. is that right because yeah. I was a yeah. Mega Drive guy and I was always like I had this little thing on the controller bin it had mono on there and I had to yeah. put a volume up on that yeah. so the snares would be like oh yeah well we got like way better sound it's that 0.5 bit extra but it's yeah it's not necessarily I mean because the sound output you could get stereo sound through headphones if you had the Mega Drive 1 oh yeah but Mega Drive 2 was stereo output yeah, built in Mega Drive 1 all mod cons then 2 or mod cons yeah but it was if you hooked up a Mega Drive 1 to a Mega CD or a 32X you could get the stereo output from that because it took the uh, this is fascinating stuff um, it, it took the the audio and video and went through the 32X and kind of com- converted it all so you got a better sound quality if you uh, if you okay. paid another 60 odd quid for an attachment that that's worth it. No, it doesn't sound like it was. No, no, it's... <laughs> well, it's like buying the um, PlayStation 4 now and you're just like, oh, well, you've got to have the VR. You've got to have the camera. Yeah, you've got to have yeah, the move. You've got to have all this. Yeah. It's got to make your £300 console at least £500. At least with the uh, Nintendo Switch, you haven't got to get any of that, except for the charging the mount Where's and the, the uh, sh- spare sh- controller sh- and the memory card. I haven't got it this time. I thought I'd do that oh, for you. Yeah, yeah. Whoosh- the, yeah, you know, um, I bought a how Switch. How many did we have on because, that? Episode? How many? Uh, yeah, how many times? Oh, did I that didn't happen? count. Oh, you should have counted. Because I was going to listen to that episode. I, I went I through. To that episode I went through the edit, it. and um, yeah, no, I didn't count during the edit because I think I was a bit fed up with hearing that noise. It was because he was actually just saying the word "switch" and I was like, <laughs> actually listening Where through it. it Wherever it was, there's yeah. one. There's one time when we say "switch" and we don't actually do the noise. I like the fact you say "we." <laughs> we. Yeah, it was just yeah, it was yeah. just me. So like we weren't in control of that. But you the console the itself, if it's if it's switched on, we. if it's powered on, and the Joy-Con controllers have been detached, when you plug them in, it makes that noise. Is that what they called them, Joy-Con? Yeah, they're called the Joy-Con controllers. The Joy-Con. Joy-Con, isn't it? Joy-Con. Yeah, the Joy-Con. Yeah, Joy-Con, right, Joy-Con. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So wow. when you He's when you clip them on to the have, actual when you get conned, <laughs> yeah, oh, it's nice. I really like the switch. I, I, re- I actually you Zelda gotta stop flip flopping on me, man. Because I said I really wanted that console, and then listen to that one switch podcast with you, and you turned me off completely from it. And now you're saying you want it again. I wasn't sold on it, and t- I had to. The thing is, I had to have it in my hands. Oh, I had that game. I had. Don't look at that. I can't stop help looking. It. <laughs> what? None of your business. I'm doing it. I'm doing it now. I'm doing it. (laughs) (laughs) 
the yeah i wasn't sold on it until i got to play on it right and i actually really like it it's the imp- it's kind of they've taken everything that they've done Wait, previously on the wii u on the wii u yeah they've <laughs> taken all the mistakes that they've learned and hopefully no, if no, we get this they didn't learn any mistakes well i'd be so yeah no i if if we don't get the software then they definitely haven't learned by from their mistakes but it's it's really nice the fact that uh, if my wife's watching tv and i want to play on it i just pick it out of the dock what is just, it the console your wife <laughs> <laughs> what play with my wife yeah <laughs> when was the last um, time that happened? oh <laughs> <laughs> She's not listening, is she? It's live, isn't it? Um, I wouldn't have thought she was listening. No? No. Does she listen to it when it's been recorded? Hey. Then she doesn't listen to it live. She's not yeah, she doesn't live. listen to me no. anyway, regardless yeah. of this or not. Anything. Um, oh, yeah, no, I'd turn that over. Because otherwise I'm going to keep looking at it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so do you have... Anyway, would Switch is... We're not going to talk about the Switch because uh, I think Jack and the guys are going to be talking about that in length later well actually um, if that's if that's the case I'm now I've got um, for the next hour I want to talk about the Nintendo Switch <laughs> well then um, you can oh, I haven't got enough money <laughs> Phil can I borrow a pound Do you want to... <laughs> well, I put five pound in I think I only saw three times so oh well then you can fall out it <laughs> <laughs> your uh, no, help right. is needed at another settlement <laughs> um, no if you God want to talk about Preston. Switch, you can piss off and you can join them a lot later he, he, he swore he swore yeah I know there's Phil's donating do a pound for me oh oh yeah because of the five I wasn't listening you still got oh, an extra we, pound on top of that we'll put, D, cap, we'll, bo- <laughs> we'll put the bottle cap in just on the off chance that Phil's money's not real or the uh, Queen's only got one eye <laughs> still worth something is it yeah. a little one eyed Queen yeah half the valley isn't that, isn't that what they call you at the pub? <laughs> That's what I was about to say. That. <laughs> That's why I laughed first, and then was like, "I'll wait for Stephen to finish." But I know a guy Arr. called that. Yeah, Welcome to my pub, my hearties. Welcome to the Four Horsemen. Who wants to stroke my beard? <laughs> I don't know where that I don't was know going. Why. No. Yeah, um, so, do you have any more to say about Goldeneye? Um, well, no. Apart from Phil, how would you say I, I played on the game? Terrible. Terrible. Yeah. yeah. So I'm a terrible Goldeneye. Game player. Um, I completed it numerous times and shut up, Phil. And uh, <laughs> terrible, terrible, yeah, terrible, terrible. Um, I think I got about. I got to the caves. So I don't. Oh yeah. Um, I think those what? are the first stages. Wait, uh, is it the where you're sort of going into um, the caves? Oh, they, yeah, the, the, caves. the underground caves, and you have to. Natalia has to hack the console, and you have to keep her um, oh, protected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know the the person who was the bad? Because obviously, they had the Natalia was the good girl in in the movie. Yep. And you had the bad Famke Janssen. Famke Janssen. Famke. Is, is that the actress name for yeah, Natalia? Xena yeah. on the top. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Do you know? Do you know she who actually? Hot. Yeah. Do you know who actually played that that person? Famke Janssen. I the just said the that. other one. Sorry. The other the bad girl. That's that is the bad girl. There's, no, the, Who's the, good the one who went on to play Dean <laughs> Grey in X Men. Was it? Yeah. No, because Amy Jo Johnson was one of them in there. No, because she was Pink Ranger. Yeah, exactly. She's a Pink Power Ranger. She wasn't in Golden Eye. Yeah, she was. No, she wasn't. No, yeah, she was. Ranger, right. That's all she does. Good thing we have the internet. Okay. Good thing we've got that, isn't it? <laughs> oh, by the way, the guy who played um, Vanderhoff didn't. He's not. He's still alive. Is he? He's still alive. Yeah, Brian Doyle Murray. Hold of him. No, Brian no, no, Doyle no, no, Murray. No, no. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Oh yeah, that's yeah, yeah. That's Bill. No, Murray. it's Bill Murray's brother. That Bill Murray's. Wow, that's not you. That Bill Murray looks really old. <laughs> that's what happens with age. Just look at those grey hairs. Thanks, Phil. <laughs> but that yeah, was harsh. Brian Doyle Murray played Vanderhoff. <laughs> right, I need to find out. Golden Eye. Um, Thanks, Phil. But no, it was not. Amy Jo Johnson was not in Golden Eye. She was in Golden Eye. She wasn't. I'm telling you, she was in Golden Eye. She was not. I'm. Just, Sticking to my guns on this one. You should do, but you're wrong. No. <laughs> oh crap. Money. Oh yeah. Is she? Was she? Was she? Oh no, no, she wasn't. Oh no. rubbish. Oh. oh. No. <laughs> Get it wrong. I was so happy about that. <laughs> Fake news. It was Isabella Skorupko who played Natalia Simonova. I'm giving more fake news Boris? than Trump. Your mum? I am invincible. 
Yeah. That wasn't a clue. I was just doing. Oh, okay. Who who played Boris? Uh, Alan Cummings. Well that, done. I'm not going to put any swear words in for that one. <laughs> <laughs> and who is Alec Trevelyan? Uh, Sean Bean. He dies in every movie. And who is Jack Wade? Ah. Uh? The uh, the American guy. What? Rob, what? Oh. I was about to see Robbie Coltrane. I'm blocking his name up. I have no idea who that is. That's Joe Don Baker. Good. Oh, okay. You've oh, you're not you've not really seen many Mystery Science Theatre three thousands, have you? Oh no, I haven't. There's, it's on Netflix now. Oh, new series, fourteenth yeah. of April. Whoop whoop. Can I get a whoop whoop? What what? <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. Um, yeah, there's a couple of Joe Don Baker films in Mystery Science Theatre. There's one called Mitchell, and it's terrible, but it's so funny. I advise you uh, check it out. There's a lot of money in here, Mitchell. I only remember the one that I watched around your house where with Adam West. Oh, Adam Zombie Wee. Nightmare. Nobody messes with Adam Wee. Adam Wee. Oh my God, I'm a tomato. Um, <laughs> whilst Alan is there, hello. I think we should have some sort of a jingle or an updatey thing. An updated thing. Should we have a little comic relief appeal? I think we should have a little comic relief appeal. Let's do that. Just in case well, anybody like listening, if, if anybody's still li- Ah! <laughs> I think we should have an appeal. Okay. There's something I want to share with you, and it's good news. This is Lucy and her little boy, born just two days ago. Doesn't even have a name yet. Partly because of your donations to Comic Relief, he's been born into a country where mosquito nets are being made available to more and more families and are saving lives every day. Because of vaccines you are helping fund for children, the mortality rate has been dramatically reduced. But we're not quite there yet. I went to the main hospital in Malongwe, Malawi's capital, to see what still needs to be done. I met Jean, a nurse in the children's ward. It's nice to see you, Jean. Thanks for letting us come here. You. You are very welcome. So how many kids do we have here on this bed? We have five kids on this bed, and most of the kids here have been treated for malaria. Majority of these women don't have the mosquito nets. And mosquito nets could have prevented the kids from getting malaria. Yeah. The ward is overrun with cases of malaria. So there are two floors to this hospital because it's not only busy on this floor, it's also busy on this floor. There just simply aren't enough beds to go around. There are too many cases to fit these beds, so people have to sit on the floor, do whatever they can to look after their children. A new case has been admitted. It's a little boy called Tim Banny. And he's finding it hard to breathe. His mum and dad, along with his baby brother, have travelled for over four hours to get him to hospital. He was admitted with complaint of chest pains, coughing and shortness of breath. That child is very sick and has got a very severe disease. Tin Banny has also tested positive for malaria, and it's devastating news for his mum. Tin Banny's mum has been in this situation before. Even before Tin Banny was born, she lost a son. He was an infant too, the same age as Tin Banny is now. It's vital that Tenbani's breathing is stabilized, but there's not enough oxygen pumps to go around, so the only option now is to pump air into Tenbani's body by hand. But there aren't enough medical staff, so it's up to Tenbani's dad to help keep his son alive. All through the night, desperate to see any sign of recovery, Tenbani's dad hand-pumped oxygen for his little boy. But eventually, Tenbani had become too weak to cope, 
and he went into cardiac arrest. We're back. Oh, hello. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. I actually like that. That was that was good. That was actually really nice. That sounded like you were loud. Hello, Wisconsin! Is that why I sound like? Ooh, I really ooh. like the sound of my own voice. <laughs> well, that's the only reason we're doing this, is because we needed other people to hear the sound of our glorious voices. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Trying to reach a wider audience and do some good at the same time. Oh, what are we doing good for, Ant? That is because we are uh, raising money for Comet Relief. And if you can spare any money at all, please donate. To date through our Red Nose Day giving page, head to www.superpod.co.uk and click donate, donate in the top right-hand corner. Every single penny you donate goes to Comet Relief, helping support those in need in the UK and Africa. And if you're a UK taxpayer, don't forget to say yes to the gift aid so that the government adds the extra 25% on top of your donation. With no extra cost to you, thank you. Nice. I know, right? Nice. I really wanted to do it in like, uh, like a voice. Like a, we're raising money for comic relief, and uh, mm. if you can you... spare it, shut up, Phil. I was doing it. Phil, you're ruining it. Everything you ruin everything I do. Yep. Let me have one moment in the limelight where I'm doing something great for for charity of all things. Come on. You have to come up there and ruin it. Anyway, if you can spare any money at all, please donate. Shut up, Phil. I can hear you laughing. Oh, Phil. Right. You can donate for our Red Nose Giving page www.superpod.co.uk That's you what know I would have done. Yeah, now, right. how would Bobcat Goldthwait say it? You want to hear his Bobcat Goldthwait? I want to hear it as Bobcat Goldthwait. <clears throat> you see, we raising money for my kind of relief, man. If you even spend money, it hey, no! <laughs> <laughs> You can donate for our Red Nose Day's giving page, which you can head to www.superpod.co.uk I'm going to name top right corner, man. Every single penny. I can do that all night. You that can voice. Do that I love that voice too See, much. We're in we're in big enough room that you can do it without we're our eardrums shattered, just bleeding down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, or is that? I, I, the bit I would love to at the end where it's like government adds twenty five percent of your donation. No, it costs you. Thank you. <laughs> he would say thank you really quickly afterwards. See. Scooby Doo saying this. Oh, yes, this is great. We're uh, raising money for comic relief. That's f- dreadful. I haven't got I any money left. Like- that. Yeah, I've, I haven't done it for a while. I know you All haven't. my impressions. I can do an accent. Go on, Phil. Oh, oh, is that oh what am I doing? His accent ladies is and gentlemen. This is it, a Phil, you, Phil, you Phil can impression. Read any of them. Your vo- oh, oh. Just. <laughs> Go on, Phil. Come on. And I have to think about it. You know, it takes a lot of time, doesn't it, Ant? He's got to get into the character. Come on, Phil. He's you can to... do this. <laughs> Lion face, lemon face. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I just did it. Come on. Uh, how do you do Irish again? What? To, to donate through our Red Nose Day given page, head to www. <laughs> Shut up. I'm not saying anything. It's Phil? Well, Come on. W Dibby Oh my god I've just W Diddy yeah? <laughs> I've just changed the sound Dibby 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 I got Irish people that come Okay, to my bar. if that is how you say it, please tweet in <laughs> and think? hashtag uh, <laughs> what the hashtag Superpod 2017. So if if that is how you say it, tweet us. Dibier. 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 Okay. So that nonsense. I think. Right. Are we? D- shall we do sound effects roulette, or shall we do? Uh, have we got Monkey Man news? Could find some. I brought. I did bring that thing that 
<laughs> you bought that I told thing. you about. I'll just look for some. Um, or, well, you can have that as well if you want awesome. it. Just in case. Because um, I did some homework. Because my job isn't very busy. No. Um, although I did get a nice certificate. Look. I did see that. Look at that. A certificate Common of achievement and, and excellence. What is the hanging stuff on there? It's a water Stefan for being... Stefan, what? Being, being, I know there should be a comma in there. That's done. For being, is awarded to Stefan for being Stefan. Good luck tonight. Yeah, congratulations and thank you from the management for, team for, for all of your hard Stephen, work. Good luck tonight. Congratulations. So you've got an award for being yourself. I have. <laughs> the thing is, I said when I was presented with it, who else could have won it? Yeah, there is it's pretty said, much. Who? I never win an award. Who, um, <laughs> who else could have won this award? I so I, I went into my local so. bookshop. I said, excuse me, what's this Psycho the Rapist section? The person behind the counter said, sorry, sir. I think you'll find that's psychotherapist. <laughs> Your Jimmy Carr's much better than mine. Well, I'm not. I'm all right. That wasn't Jimmy Carr. That was DeFrace. DeFrace. Yes, I'm mad. Jimmy Carr. Yes, well, would it be a um, very, 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 very stupid impression indeed. J I J for uh, John <laughs> I for um, idiot. M um, M for um, um um Mike uh no I'll I'll get it in a minute okay I'm losing it now you, you could use um, Mike <laughs> yes so uh, sound effects roulette or we've got maybe Monkey Man news if sound Phil has uh, I think Phil's saying not Monkey Man news not Monkey Man news sound or roulette. we can uh, I have gone back in time, time. <laughs> um I have the ten years ago charts. As was, you remember that feature? I remember that feature. Those it was amazing. Were the days. That was the good old days when Halcyon we were organised. Back in the day. Um, what, we've got, got I've got the 10 years ago charts. I've got the 20 years ago charts. Shut the front door. So what I do don't we have want, to pay for what, that one. We'll put it out to the audience. Ha ha, charity. <laughs> <laughs> what are, you, are you saying ha ha to charity? Yeah, it's, uh, this is all about comedy, isn't it? Red Nose Day is um, good plug, good save. <laughs> I See, <laughs> you would think it was all about comedy, but then Lenny Henry was on the screen last night. I didn't laugh once. <laughs> so it has to be about the charity. Yeah. Did you see his wife? No, because uh, him and Dawn French aren't together anymore. Did you see his wife? When did they break up? Ages ago. Ages like, ago. Two, three years ago. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They broke up and then she lost loads of weight, as tends to be. That's why he started doing the Premier Inn. Bit of wobbling and wheezing. Oh, that's why he was yeah, doing those adverts. There you go. He so he had to go and stay at Premier Inn. Oh. <laughs> like, Everything's Premier but the price. Like, yeah. They were like, she kept everything, so he's now living in a Premier in like, Alan Partridge. <laughs> um, so we're going to put it to the crowd. Do we want 10 years ago charts? And this is going to be, we got Jack. He's going to want 20 years ago charts, old yeah. school gamer. Um, so 10 years ago, 20 years ago charts, what do we reckon? 20. 20. 20. I thought that might be the popular choice. Popular choice. I went on doors it then. The old folks, popular. 20 years ago charts. <laughs> right. Um, we'll do the whole top 20 because uh we've got time games, to burn. we have got time for that we are currently looking at yeah and no, we got time for that okay <laughs> we've got some uh, some of the time for that we do so in at number 20 yeah. diablo you, you haven't done the whole for thing, have you? pc uh? oh you want me to do oh that? yeah we used to that was a thing as that well that was a thing back in the day we've evolved which was from a wednesday well oiled machine that we used to be um 20 there you go oh am i doing it as well yeah yeah, yeah remember you had to do it as well Phil, you are part of this trio. Yeah, I remember the group. 20. Well oh. done. Thanks, Phil. Diablo, PC CD ROM. Yeah, I remember that one. I never really played Diablo. I was never a PC gamer back in the day. You weren't part of the elite race? I wasn't. I'm, I'm not really part of the elite race now. <laughs> Nor a PC gamer. <laughs> okay, 19. Go on, Phil. 19. There you go. I don't know why I did that. Oh, did you say it already? Yeah. No, he said it. Yeah, no, I heard him say it, but yeah. uh, you, you looked at me it? as if, yeah, yeah. Well, no, you got me to no do we both all say last time. It. Well, yeah, but nineteen. Stop copying me. The, the, how that is that copying you? Reeves impersonation of Barry White. Listened to me and then said it again. Did I? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, Phil. That's all right. Copycat. Nineteen. Possibly, <laughs> if anyone's coming up with a top five of games based on movies, this is probably number two. Probably number two. You know, I want an impression of it so much. Die Hard trilogy. You want to stay alive? Stay with me. I love massive. that line. It's a ah, oh, that was a game and a half. PlayStation. Yeah, it was. I never played the second one. Go left. No, I mean right. Thanks, Samuel L. Jackson. That was helpful. <laughs> <laughs> he, I was watching uh, footage of it, 
And he said it, he would say it right at the last minute. Yeah. He would go, go left. No, I mean right. And it's literally, you know, which way do I go? Left or right? And then it blew up and then everything was, everyone was dead. Yeah. So you would have had to have played the routes over and over and over again to I actually did. know where you had to go. Excuse yeah. me. I remember when I, because I was quite young when it came out, I remember um, I'd always try and get into a police car and then pretend I was a, a New York policeman. And then, like, it'd always blow up because I was always trying to be a policeman. To, like, New York was always being destroyed. I was so good at being a cop. Skills. Fun fact. Fun fact there, <laughs> folks. You heard it here first. Whenever I say fun fact, it usually does not mean it's fun or a fact. She just say it just fun. without the oomph. The, fun, the oomph bit. Yeah. Yeah. Just, here's something, here's something. <laughs> 18. <laughs> 18. Sorry, I've cracked up on that one. Phil, say, just repeat what I just said. Sorry, Phil. Are we keeping you away? Wait, yeah, mate. Yeah. Alan, he's been here since Cracker Sparrows this morning. <laughs> what and the, you're, what the Sparrows look like? I, I don't know. Right. I wasn't here. Alan was. You have to ask him. All right. 18. Tomb Raider. Get Original Tomb Raider on PC CD-ROM. It was a good game. Good game. It was a good game. It was where it all started. Yeah. Did you try and get all the jade monkeys because you believed that if you got all the jade monkeys at the end of the game in the shower scene, you would see her pixelated boobs? Because no, it didn't happen. Funny. It wasn't true. I thought that was the second one. No, the first one. Then, no. It was terrible. Because you, you, did, see, you, you couldn't see you, the pixelated boobs. You spent you hours see. collecting those uh, jade monkeys. I love jade monkeys. And didn't see any 16-bit, <laughs> no, 32-bit boobs. 32-bit, yeah. Oh. Not one of them. Not either of them. It's, that is a shame. Yeah. None All of you them. had was this Lara Croft League game. No. That's literally a new, you tried to go into a, sure a room yeah, yeah. that you couldn't get into. No. no. It wasn't the butler from the second one with his top nah. off. Oh, that was great. With his yeah. top off? Yeah. What was he doing with his top off? Yeah. The amount of times I used to literally just kill, um, just jump into her empty pool and just like swan dive into it and break her own neck just to hear the... Oh, yeah. That was a good noise. <laughs> <laughs> you two are monsters. I like that noise. <laughs> and then lock him in the freezer. Yeah, just yeah, yeah. He's gonna die. He never did, did he? No. See, I only really I knew of Tomb Raider. I never really owned any of them myself. So, I, but um, the later ones from uh, Anniversary and Legend, I sort of owned them from that period when they were kind of rebooting. Yeah, the first reboot. And uh, and I like the new ones as well because it's basically Uncharted. Great game. Yes. We're not going to talk about that one because I play. I talk about that for well the first game because that's where I've got up to so far. But anyway, back to the charts. Seventeen. 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 Oh my god! I just copied you, video. You copied me again, Phil. Seriously. Oh, I'm paying attention to other things as well. He what? Wants to what are you paying you attention to? What it is? Phone. Your phone. Yep. He's trying to copy my beard. That's what it is. He is. It's spectacular beard. Yeah. Well, I just want to be Silver Fox like you. I am the Silver Fox. <laughs> That's my Metal Gear Solid and name. you're like our Schofield. you damn right. Phil, you're like Holly Willoughby. <laughs> what? Because I got Holly Willoughby. Yeah. 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 And I'll be um, Gino DiCampio, or whatever his name is. Does he yeah. cook on this Yeah, the morning? chef does. Yeah, yeah. Does he, is he, it is him on there, is it? Do you cook? I see a lot of Joe Wicks on there at the moment. Midget trees. I don't know who that is. Who's Joe Wicks? The body coach. Oh, oh okay, yeah. yeah. No, whenever I think... I thought Joe Wicks was that guy with the beard that sometimes pops up on 8 out of 10 cats. Is that Joe Wilkinson? Comedian. Beard. beard. That's my mind for beard. 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 Oh, the guy who's got a bit of... He's a bit abstract. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He, Is that he not? does cat, uh, Cats as Countdown. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like that guy. But that's not Joe Wicks. No, it's not. Oh, okay. No. Uh, 16... 16. I don't know why. <laughs> I like that. Fair enough. I like that. 16. Don't know why. Championship <laughs> Manager 2 Double Pack. Oh, wow. That is an old game. Never played it's that. I've never... <laughs> yeah? Was it Was it a good one? Champ Manager 2, yeah. Champ yeah. Manager 2. Did it improve over Champ Manager 1? T- <laughs> Ten <laughs> spreadsheets. <laughs> was it, yeah. Yes, that's exactly it, what was it, it was. Was it just spreadsheets still? Yeah. Yeah. So Did you get... Is it still? It still is. Fair enough. Um... Uh, what we are 15 is well we won't do this one because 15 we've already had that's Die Hard Trilogy on the Saturn oh really the Sega's ill-fated Saturn 
It wasn't that. Um, it was. It was. It was actually a good. It didn't console. kill them. It didn't kill them, but it yet. certainly wounded them. Yeah, it did. Uh, fourteen. 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 Yeah, you did something different. Mm. Uh, Tekken, but platinum edition. Tekken one. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Tekken seven's out this year, isn't it? Yep. Should be unless they push it back again. No, they won't. They They've won't. got Akuma in this one. Akuma Matata? Yeah. <laughs> what a wonderful phrase. <laughs> Special characters. Special characters. Oh. They've not even mentioned it just till just before release. Yeah. Yeah. And <laughs> DLC. Yeah, there'll be DLC. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're not EA, so it won't be... Uh, It'll be buy through, buy through game and you can get it. Pre-order only. The only place you can buy games now. characters <laughs> who fight. Who do, we re- who do we reckon the characters will be? What was that wooden one? Oh. Mokujin. Was it Mokujin, yeah. was it? Yeah. It'll be Mokujin. That, Mokujin that little dinosaur, Goji. Gone. 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 Yeah. And it'll be um, uh, Yoshimitsu, but with a different outfit. Yoshimitsu, that's the one who used to... Uh, yeah, yes, that's it. Yeah, he used to sit on the ground and be like, just literally just looks like... I know what he looked like he was doing. He had a massive sword. And Is Eddie, Eddie Gordo in this one? Eddie Is he in Gordo wins. Yeah. Everyone likes players Eddie Gordo because they win. Yeah, oh, just, you just button, button bashing, bash, don't yeah. you? But who? Chicken. Good chicken. <laughs> I love that. Mode. That was Tekken uh, Three, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was. Yeah, Tekken Three. Yeah. Doctor... Don't cry, Phil. It's all right. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, sorry. Doctor Hal Chipman. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor Who. <laughs> no, Doctor something. B. Kevorkian. B. Oh, I can't remember what his name is. It's Doctor B. You have to oh, do that whole, yeah, yeah, yeah. The four stages, and then you have to do that four times. Yeah. To unlock the key to then take him out. No. For a nice steak dinner. <laughs> and never, and call, never them call them back. Dorothy Mandu was a saint. <laughs> Where'd you get those pants? The toilet store. You say you didn't say anything? Even the guy doesn't think there's something. <laughs> I love that film. I love that film so much. Um, but no, original <laughs> What movie is it, Phil? Character oh, of man. choice Good would man. have been. <laughs> King, <laughs> the guy with the uh, tiger face. Yeah, that's neat. That's neat. That's neat. That's neat. I really love your tiger Good face. face. Well, like Roger. <laughs> Something like that. Roger. Yeah. Roger. Kangaroo. Yeah. Did he eat pecan sandies? <laughs> Don't know. Did you ask him? <laughs> not real. Couldn't. <laughs> couldn't. Couldn't. He's not real, Phil. Don't raise your eyebrows at me, please. He is real. Okay. Yes, he's real in our hearts. Yeah. Good. Um, Don't upset me. Gun Jack. Does it look like the metal arms? Was there two? Was there Jack and Gun Jack in the first one? Yeah. And then there was a robot version. Because there was the human. I think it was Jack. I'm sure that's what he did. (laughs) Yes. That was like kind of a. uh, Nina. Nina. Yeah. Nina. Williams. Win. (laughs) (laughs) Dying. Seem to kick men and women in the balls. Yeah, she did, didn't she? Well, she's an equal uh, equal opportunity fighter. Yeah. So. <laughs> and the people she's fighting always seem to have balls. No matter if it's a dinosaur. Isn't that the same in like Mortal Kombat with um, Johnny Cage? Because you'll do the splits yes, and then you'll... The... And then even if you're... Um, Dusty! Oh, yeah. Dusty! There you go! You're doing... <laughs> you had that... That's the other bit. In, no, it wasn't. In Mortal Kombat 3, yeah. You go, Dusty! And then there's another bit when you do so another can move. can I borrow a pound? Oh, um, wow, he's going to do this. Yeah, you need to. I need, I've got nine more then. Oh, it's all right. It doesn't make him. Uh, um, no, nine more. the moment's gone. It doesn't matter. Okay. Make it rain. Make it rain. It fucking wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> they did not say. Toss yeah, me, it was. Toss me. Go. There you go. That was the other bit afterwards. After the, right, fact check it. Do the exact same it thing didn't. as we did with Amy Jo Johnson. <laughs> It didn't. You're going to have to go on YouTube, though. Posty, there you go. No, it wasn't like straight away. It was like you do a combination of moves it and it would do the toasty bit. And it that was didn't. awesome because I loved it. No. And then about, I don't know, 10 seconds after when I was still beating Phil at that game, then it would... You've never played me at Mortal Kombat. Have I not? No. I probably would beat you. No. And... What, so, right, are you saying... The most common Are character. you saying... And you press the same buttons. What, you mean Scorpion? No. Well, that's what I play as. Get over here! Yeah, that's exactly what I play as. Scorpion, so I've you're like... You're the most I'm most... talking about Street Fighter. What? No, we're talking about Mortal Kombat! I know, but I'm bringing it into Street Fighter. All right, now who are the players... Oh, yeah, I do play as Ken. Yeah. All the bloody... All the bloody time. It never times. says. There's nothing. I, I Wow! I Googled... He loves charity. I Googled I Mortal Kombat. Kombat. There you go. <laughs> 
it's got nine more. It's not in there. Toss it, they go. No, 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 what it's the, no. Up, no. All right, we'll play it. Well, Mortal Kombat 3, what is it? The, the Mortal Kombat 3, the yeah. sound effects from when you do an uppercut on someone or something. It's like just, that. every now and again, it's just, Toasty. Yeah, I know it's what it is. Toasty. No, 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 I didn't say that. It's not. Right, it's the toasty bit is when you, uh, the uppercut, and then there's yeah. a couple moves later, where you did a few more combinations of moves, it would then say something else weird like that. No. Yes. No. Yes. Oh, yeah, please, Phil, do something. Sound effects. <laughs> wow, I'm trying to find it now. Number 13. Toasty! Damn it. Command, oh. and Conquer. Command and Conquer, red alert. High five. That was rubbish. That was rubbish, but it was better. rubbish, but it was a bit better. Yeah. Oh, I love red alert. CNC. This was red alert PC rather than red alert PlayStation. Oh, okay. So it wasn't... If you were getting all that money, it didn't make the... It did make the game slow down, slow down so that you had to take a week off work just to uh, finish your match. Oh, I just dropped out of school. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it turns out it works out for me. Ding, 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 ding. Someone's about to attack me. Ding, ding. You're like, oh my God, who's going to get attacked first? <laughs> please be the other. Making, making deals with somebody else in the room just to be like, <laughs> please, just like team up, look, just help me and we'll team up, we'll get somebody else. And, and, uh, they're coming for me. Let's just, uh. Nuclear warhead detected. Ion storm detected. Unit lost. Unit lost. Unit lost. Unit Your lost. Harvester is under attack. I hated that. <laughs> Low power. Yeah. Unit lost. It was when it was the harvester you was under attack, and you only had one harvester, and you just spent all your money on like the last harvester you could afford. Yeah, and, and you were halfway only... through because you wanted two harvesters, so you put all your money into the second harvester. And then you and had then, nothing to defend your first harvester. Yeah. yeah. Or you didn't listen to the bit when I said your harvest is under attack. You didn't hear it for some reason. And then you don't have a harvester. Yeah. And you're going, why have I got no money? What's my harvester doing? I'm just watching this just to try and find it. And then I was going to turn it up. Toasty! There you go! There you go. That's, true. That's true, it happened. <laughs> it did it! It did. Uh, just like Amy Jo Johnson was in Goldeneye. Yes. <laughs> Number 12. Dusty. I'm just going to keep doing that now. There you go. <laughs> that's gonna, never going to do it. No, that's that's right, your favourite thing. It's almost as funny as Phil going, Is that? Is that? Oh, Taking it wasn't them. that, was it? It was so yeah, long yeah, yeah, time, because yeah. We were, it was the Christmas episode, and I hadn't heard what you said, and we were talking about something, and I went, Is that? And Is you that? went, Is that? Taking the mickey out of me for like 10 you minutes, and I, I mean. neither of us heard you doing it. Yeah. Until I was going through the edit and realised that you were taking the mickey out of me. I wasn't going to take the mickey out of you. My therapist heard about that. Um, Good job. Did we say number 12? No. Number 12. Number 12. Number 12. Air Combat Platinum. Had so, that game. Did you? Yeah. I played it in the arcades, but never really... Yeah, I had Air Combat. Um, not the Platinum version, because I had it on launch title. Oh. Oh, because I was really rich. I wasn't. Oh. Um, that's credit. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, air combat was an amazing game. I, I remember there was something you could do right at the very beginning. Um, when press you press start, you press start, yeah. and then you took off, <laughs> and then you shot down. Hello, the plane. games master. I'm just I'm building? trying to get past the first level in air combat. Can you help? Yes, get the internet. Oh, hello, you pluck, plucky young scamp. <laughs> Imagine you had to literally like send a letter in or actually ask someone yeah, for I cheats always... and stuff when you're growing up 20 years ago where now you just go Google See, what, how do you get past this I'm, I always wondered because who was writing in to Games Master with these things and the people who the kids that were asking on Games Master how do you know who were on the green screen, the green screen that were like hello Games Master how do you get past oh, yeah. uh, Poison Ink Zone on something how do you, I know that's wrong don't Quit. Poison ink zone on something. No, 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 wait, no, no, we're not going to let that slide because after all, if you just said to me, level, so. Do you not know about that? What, the point is ink zone? Yeah. yeah. Never heard oh, of it. Sorry. Yeah. The pointus. Pointus? <laughs> no, no, you can't do that to me. No, no, no. You said the poison ink zone. I said pointus by accident, I know, but you said the poison ink zone on Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, right? Yeah, it's, we'll just, we'll edit it's, this out. It's, it's at fine. the end. Oh, is it the. It's, the, it's when you finish the game. With all the, em- the chaos emeralds. You've got to write a letter to let the games master. But if you write it wrong, they poison you. It's the poison ink zone. The poison ink zone. The poison ink zone. Poison ink yeah. zone on Sonic 2. Yeah, yeah. Sonic 2. Special Sonic, is that secret. Sonic and Knuckles? No. Is it the. Is it it's Knuckles. Knuckles put a different Sonic game in the and top? Knuckles and John Cena. And John Cena? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is it not where you get like Sonic and Knuckles and then put like Sonic Mario 2 in the top of it? 
and then you get the poison ink zone. Yes, <laughs> that's that's exactly right, Phil. And you have to do up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, A, B, start. Sweet. Um, knows that now. I, I could always no, that up, see, down, see, left, see, right, see one on, but, the, on the Mega Drive. Can I, I can't to work. So the people writing in, I'm not. I'm guessing they're like. Get the people, the producers at Games Master were like, "Oh, that, that's a really good question. Um, let's get that kid in, put him on a green screen, get yeah, him to talk to the uh, disembodied head of Patrick Stewart." Stewart yeah, no, Patrick Stewart. Patrick Stewart. Commander Wolf's head looks like a fanny. Um, Patrick <laughs> Moore. Yeah, Patrick, Patrick Moore. Moore. Yeah, yeah. Sky at night, Patrick Moore. <laughs> You're dead now. Yeah, yeah. I don't mean. This minute, this, uh, it was that, was, that isn't breaking news. No, if you just found I'm, out, by I'm the terribly, way, I'm sorry, sorry. <laughs> everybody. He died. Just that. Oh, <laughs> I get that. That's actually a joke on the Red Nose Day, isn't it? That's yeah. a Ricky Gervais joke, isn't it? Yeah, it is actually. Considering I don't like that guy, Phil loves Ricky Gervais. I hate Ricky Gervais. I saw him this week. Did you? Yeah, Wait I saw his time. new humanitarian tour. Oh, is I it saw good? It. Oh, humanity. Uh, human- uh, yeah, humanity tour. I um, saw it on. Why is it I think it's, money? It's the funniest son I've ever seen in my life. But anyway, uh, <laughs> the first 15 minutes, he was making a joke about the Bruce Jenner, Caitlyn Jenner thing. When it comes out on DVD, you will see why I was almost in tears. Because it the, was terrible. It was not terrible, Phil. It was, it was, it, it was, it was some of the funniest terrible. comedy I've ever heard in my life. And, um, oh, red nose. Red nose. I've still got red nose away. And... Um, it was so funny about oh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say anything about it other than it, it was, was the terrible. it was the funniest it was, it was the funniest was joke was I've ever heard. Because I've I've been listening going back and listening to all of his old podcasts. It's hard to drive <laughs> when you are laughing so hard, there's tears streaming down your face, you just can't see out the windscreen, yeah. can't concentrate on driving, but it's so funny. It was so yeah. funny. Carl Pilkington. I can't. I can't work out if Carl Pilkington Carl. is actually. I always forget how much you hate like Ricky Gervais. I forget or that. Yeah. If he's, <laughs> or if he's actually that stupid, or if it's like the best character that anyone's ever come up with. Yeah. No, I think he's just stupid. That's why he's so funny. Whereas Ricky Gervais is just a plain idiot. What was it you said? You said to um, Ricky Gervais when you said you saw him that he wasn't funny. He was a waste of time. And what did he say to you back? I just walked away before he said anything back. Oh, that's right. Phil just walked away. Yeah. I was 13. Just oh, like, you were finished. What a lamb. He ran retort. up and he went, Your promise. No, no. He asked, <laughs> ran away. No, he, he went, He said, you Got him a good one. He said, Do you want an autograph? I was like, I'm not going to waste my time with your autograph. I don't want your autograph. Well, that's not what you said. You said to him just now. Yeah, you said you just poked him on the shoulder, said something horrible, and ran away. Now it's now it's becoming that you went into this whole monologue in your head. You know. Just like, excuse Things me, change. Excuse face. people change. These are the reasons I don't like you. Get yeah. a notebook. <laughs> Page one. Thank you. Did he do his annoying laugh at you? He did that a lot. No, I meant to Phil when Phil told him he didn't like him. I don't know. I didn't really give two. He thoughts. doesn't know because it's all fictitious. <laughs> I don't really care. Uh, number 11. <laughs> I'm just waiting for this. Number 11, all right? <laughs> number 11. Is uh, Tomb Raider on PlayStation. Okay. Uh, number 10. Dece. We're now in top 10. Hang on. French. <laughs> Do you know the difference? Between French and Jewish. <laughs> that, what? Jewish is uh, not sorry, a language. I, do, uh, I've ju- I think I've just missed something happening. What was... What? I, what? You asked me what Dece was. No, I said, is that French? And he goes, no, it's Jewish. <laughs> Okay. Which is wrong anyway, because Jewish isn't... <laughs> it's not... Language. They have got their own language. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, Wipeout Platinum was number 10 on the That's PlayStation. It's a good game. New one uh, being all HD'd, isn't it? Good soundtrack. Yes. Yeah, it had like Chemical Brothers and Underworld and stuff on it, didn't it? I was always more an Extreme G kind of a guy. So that's Roll Cage. I like Roll Cage. Yeah, Roll Cage came a bit after, Later. didn't it? Yeah. But uh, yeah. So, yeah, what's that one yeah. that always just give me a migraine? F Zero X. Oh, what on the N sixty four? F Zero X was GX good on the GameCube. Let's play F Zero X. Oh, we used to really? Play that on the fastest speed. Yeah. Hardcore, too hardcore it. for me. Well, I'm not with it and hitting everything and dying every two seconds. It's like someone said, "Let's take some acid and make a racing game." But you quite liked um, Fast Racing Neo that we played at EGX, didn't you, Phil? 
Yeah, that's all right. That was good, actually. They've um, got a new version of it out on the uh, Switch. Have they? It's really good. Is it? Love it, yeah. Fast Rumrix. Rumrix. I, I, we got a um, review copy of Fast Racing Neo um, for Wii U and really liked it. And then they brought out some DLC and I got in touch with Shinnan, who make it, and I got no response about reviewing the DLC. And then Fast Rumux was due to come out and it's supposed to be Remix. Can't find that thing about. And I emailed them again and I said, oh, we'd be really interested in covering um, Fast Remix. Um, and I didn't hear anything from them then. I was like, well, hang on a minute. You were nice enough to reply and sort us out. They must not like my uh, review. <laughs> but um, uh, it's a fascinating story for you. Uh, what, sorry? Well, we uh, with our reviews, we don't uh, give scores. So that might have annoyed them. <laughs> but no, I gave it, I gave it a favourable <laughs> review because I really, I really enjoyed it. Thought it was a really good game and... Um, I gave it a good review, so I don't know. Meh. I think you did put a few things in there saying you didn't like that. Didn't like what? I don't know. Have you read my review? A little bit. (laughs) You scanned it. You scanned it. Yeah, I scanned it. Scanned the bullet points. Looking for errors. Well, if that's what I mean to you, Phil. (laughs) Scanned it for errors? (laughs) (laughs) Scanned it for errors? I literally, as soon as he said that, I was like, (laughs) right. Oh, no, he did. Mr. Scanned it for errors. <laughs> you just watch the website next time one of your reviews goes out. It is going out unedited. I was joking. Yeah. <laughs> I was. Bull pats. <laughs> Can't use I'm, my I'm, antenna anymore. Yeah, no, I've. Yeah. Um, number nine. Number nine. Top of the morning to you. Have a number nine. <laughs> <laughs> What is it? What's wrong with how many beers have you had? He's had like three. Yeah. Yeah, three. It hasn't even started on that keg next to him. Pass him over. Pass him over. I want to see the percentages of them. No, not much. It's four, three point, that's three point six. Um, that's probably about three point six oh, percent share beer. A car with him on yeah. the. Not even a beer. <laughs> no, it's a fruit beer. It's a fruity beer. Yeah, it's definitely a fruity beer. It's a fruit. No, no, it's a fruit beer. Fruity, it's a fruit beer. Fruity. 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 There you go. Have a weird beer. <laughs> <laughs> Number what nine is a was... picture of that guy? He's got a it's a cone head. head. It's got a pointy head. It's an American beer. That's like, is it Dan Aykroyd? Dan Aykroyd, yeah. yeah, yeah. Cone Dan Aykroyd. Head. Conehead Ale. Yeah, yeah. It's a free sample. Dan Aykroyd and... and uh... Oh, what's her? Christine... Nope. The, the, who's the daughter? Not... No. Because the mum, that's the one from... Um... True Lies. Jamie Lee Curtis? Yeah. It's not Jamie Lee Curtis. It's the, that's not Jamie Lee Curtis. No, no, the mum is the one that's from um, Jamie Lee Curtis, really? <laughs> Who am I thinking? Jamie I'm sure it's Jamie Lee it's Curtis. It's the third rock from the sun. It's the one that's going to have John Nifko in that. Oh, she's in Legion. It's she? Jane. Jane Austen. Jane Austen. It's not Jane Austen. Jane Austen in Third Rock from the Sun. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's Jane Austen? <laughs> Jane. <laughs> Who's Jane Austen saying to me? <laughs> she's, in, she's in Legion and she was in the second season of Fargo. Jane Austen. It's not Jane Austen. But the daughter, that's the one. Who's Christina going, Applegate. Not, is it Applegate or is it the other Christina, the one that's going to have Ben, uh, ben Seller? That is Christina Applegate. Yeah, no, it's it's, Jane Austen. that's not Christina Applegate. It's definitely, not Jane Austen. <laughs> that might be a picture of Jane Austen, yes, but she's not beers. in Coneheads. <laughs> that's, that's not her. No, that's not her at all. Anyway, number, number nine was Scourge of Armageddon. No, Never heard of it. Scourge? Sc- uh? Scourge of yes. Armagon. Oh, I've never God. even heard of that. Anyone heard of that? It was on uh, PC. I'm getting out Would of here. Would have been about, ni- well, it's 1997. Okay. Would have been about 1997. About 1997. Yeah, it's cheap. Half the price. Uh, number eight. Eight. <laughs> you've kind of, you've yeah. kind of given up, haven't you, on that, on these numbers <laughs> ones? I have about, Give me the... I'm looking at Jane Austen, all right? Do it... <laughs> Are you not saying it? Do it, do it in Jewish. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and that's our last listener gone. That's it. Um... Number eight was Cool Borders. Cool oh, that was a good game. <laughs> I was going to say Cool Borders on PlayStation. I love that game. Wait a minute. Say Borders. It's a good game. Borders. Now say Cool. 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 Now say Cool Borders. Cool. Whip. Cool Borders. Number seven. Number seven. Destruction Derby 2. 
Brilliant game. You've blown your radiator. Roadkill. <laughs> it's such a good game. We had um, uh, Luke, my mate Luke, good old buddy, old pal. His <laughs> copy of his PlayStation and his copy of Destruction Derby 2 was so beat up that um, we could play it, but it kept skipping all over the place so all the sound samples would just play randomly oh, so you it. could just be driving down the straight and you'd get you blown your radiator you're like what you just, you just started it was so yeah you just gone past start you blown your radiator what? yeah yeah <laughs> just on the title screen because <laughs> that was the when they, they the bowl in the second one had the the bit the lump in the middle so you'd actually be able to well they had different yeah, ones yeah. didn't they they had the one with yeah. the, the middle that had gone so you had to drive around the outside like two trailer outside, park girls the outside yeah, yeah. <coughs> uh, you had the other one which was like a massive ramp <laughs> there and then there was one that had the dip in you're a massive ramp <laughs> <laughs> he is for your friends you know, I worked out <laughs> when I was when I was yes! doing the uh, profile for uh, our profile for um the uh, Superpod website, I actually looked up the uh, details for how tall you have to be to be considered a giant. <gasps> Please say it's over six foot seven. No, you have to be seven foot to be con- actually considered a giant. Seven foot. No, you're not. No. So Phil yeah. is, once again, Phil is three inches short. <laughs> I'm always three inches short. He's lo- just lacking by three inches, <laughs> but it's an important <laughs> three inches. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Phil. <laughs> Don't say sorry to me. Boom. Say sorry to the missus. I think she understands. Yeah, she knows. She knows. She's been there. Uh, okay, we are now getting into the realms of awesomeness. So, number six. What was that sound, <laughs> Phil? <laughs> Phil's part that's Phil close enough to the mic <laughs> that that's going to be picked up. Yeah, that's going to be picked up. <laughs> that's Phil saying six. Super, super, super. <laughs> 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 Just, uh, no, that was the last one. Pilot Wing 64. Love that game. Amazing Absolutely love game. that game. Yeah, yeah. Swooping in on that little gyrocopter thing. Was that the one where it had like you had to go through air vents to go up higher sometimes? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, you had the bird man suit, wing suit thing that you had to flap your arms and. Yeah, that Is was that the a one tough that basically game. you're basically Michael Keaton. I've not seen the film, I've not seen it, Birdman. Is it Birdman, isn't it? Yeah, Birdman. I've, I've got it. I think I've got it, but I haven't, I've not not gone around to watch it. Nothing to do with Alcatraz. No. Not one bit. I Yeah. Uh, and I've been to Alcatraz. No, we, nothing to do with it. Was it good? Well, Alcatraz. Was the uh, guard saying about how they used to uh, take the guy and <laughs> yes. it with his eye socket, whatever it was? What's the line from Sorry Married and Axe? Um, and they would all take turns pissing into the bitch's cranial eye socket. Yeah. Everyone's just like Did you put two pounds in there? I did. I got oh, a, nice. I can swear I can swear again. Shit. <laughs> well done. Thank you. Uh number five. Five I love five. that little that little one, huh? Five. That's a good one, wasn't it? Five. There you go. <laughs> Toasty. There you go. There you go. Destruction Derby It platinum. happened. It happened. What? It didn't happen. It happened. Get over it. It didn't happen. So hang on. Did in this like chart here? Destruction Derby won. Is higher than Destruction Derby 2. All right, hang on. Destruction Derby 2 has last... The month, previous month, was in at number six. And that's Destruction a new entry. Destruction Derby Platinum. This is Platinum. See, yeah. it says it there. New entry. Well, you schooled me. Always, mate. Always. Always. I'm always schooling you. <laughs> Toasty. <laughs> there you go. Uh, just, you're just bitter about that's the whole be Amy Joe Johnson grave. thing. Yeah, it will be. Yeah. Here lies Amy Jo Johnson was not in GoldenEye. Toasty, <laughs> here you go. <laughs> I've an unmarked grave, actually. But. Yeah. And he's going to have a picture of your cat in a tie. <laughs> in his morning tie. Say Toasty, here you go. Yeah, meowing it. Because yeah. you do, your cat Shmoke does me. wear a tie, doesn't he? Yeah. He does. He has got a tie, yeah. He has yeah. got a tie. He's very. He's the smartest dresser. He's like Top Cat, only he doesn't have a hat. Yeah. And he doesn't have a <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. Does he live in a bin? Yeah, Top Cat did. No, Jay. Jay. He's been in a bin. Do, do you have? Do you have <laughs> another you cat that. called Silent Bob? Yeah, and Silent if Bob. so, if not, why not? Yeah, I only have the one cat. If I was to have two cats at any one time, I've had a cat before where I've had two cats at the same time, which cuddles and kisses. But um, <laughs> no, right. <laughs> 
Christie, there you go. No, not having that. <laughs> Cuddles was a beautiful cat. She's dead now. Kisses. <laughs> and Kisses, I'm sure, is dead also. She was my was cat. A beautiful cat. Which one? Both Cuddles. Cuddles. No, was Kisses. Was Kisses a boy or a girl? It's when he goes out into that remember. garden. Cuddles, Kisses, Din Dins. I did. Oh my God, I had to do that stuff. It was so horrible. You did it in that voice as well. In a little pinny. Cuddles. In the Cuddles, middle of Boscombe High Street. Dinner. <laughs> that why everyone stayed away from your front door yeah that and, and your back door <laughs> no one's ever got close to my back door Phil it's not what I've heard it's not what you've done Phil <laughs> not yet number four <laughs> number four is four fingers it's magic <laughs> the gathering micro pros the original well done that was uh, unless well you probably read it on there I uh, know micro pros was one of my favourite developers growing up Oh yeah, we've had we've talked about that because um, F nineteen like Stealth Fighter and Clancy. Tom Clancy became yet yeah, Red Storm Rising games. Sorry, and then you saw it Magic the Gathering. No, I didn't. You did. No, you did. You told me about that. No, I was lying. You, I've got a tenner in there. You fucking bastard. He has. That's two. That's you've only got eight pounds left. Yeah. Yeah. So, so one of you liked Magic the Gathering for a little while. Oh yeah, yeah, seven. Damn. I played the. They <laughs> made one. Ads. They made the. Do not. Ad. I have problems with numbers, Phil. And they have problems. Go with on, you. make fun of me. Yeah, I will. Sorry. What are you wow, it's got sour in here. All of I know, right? Number two. Because he's drunk. I'm not drunk. Drunk on power. Three percent beer. Drunk on his fruity beer. I have you know that's a nice beer. Uh, yep. Number two. Doors. Two. Turok, Dinosaur Hunter. Help me, Turok. Uh, see, I never played the first one. Played the second, second played one. Played the hell out of the second And I played one. Rage Wars as well, but never the first one. Well, first they... one was all right, from what I hear. It was quite... You never never played it? No one in the crowd? No. My mate Ryan had it. He's come around and play it. Um, but apart from that, nope. Two. The second one was good, and that was the whole reason I got the expansion pack for the N64. Oh, look at you. That, yeah. you know, the money's... Yeah, uh, it was probably a birthday. Uh, no, what was I? 97. You were, what, 32? I'm not that old. I would have been 17. Whoa. Uh, what, really? When, 92? Yeah. In 70, what year? 72. <laughs> I'm you not would have been 32 old. and 72? In, in, in 97? I, 17 in 97. Yeah, yeah. What would I have been? 12. A glint 12. in the milkman's eye, Phil. 97. How old were you in 97? 97. How old are you now? 28. How old are you? In? How, when was you born? 89. Oh. So you'd have been 8. I'd have been 8. Depending on the time of year. Yeah. What so this is this is March. Well, that's when I was born. So there you go, you'd have been 8. I'd have been 8. Yeah. Glad Eight we established months. that. Yeah. Happy birthday. Oh, by the way, happy birthday, Phil, from the other day. I really forgot oh, yeah, about it. Birthday, I completely forgot it was your birthday. Did you get any nice presents? <laughs> is this why he's bitter with me? <laughs> he's, he's old and sullen. It was on Facebook. It goes, it's Phil's birthday, and I went twat. <laughs> <laughs> Douche. <laughs> Douche or douche? I didn't do that. I phoned him up, and said it. <laughs> I was just like Phil. Phil, it's your birthday, huh? It was, yeah. it was before midday, so he was still in bed. <laughs> Probably. Oh well, no, I was up. Sure. Up where? I was up probably having a shower at midday. I didn't really phone him. No. No, no one, I, I no one did. A, I, I think I sent you a message like, happy birthday. I think you did. Happy birthday, sweetness. I think Aunt definitely sent me one. <laughs> sent, it, sent you a Was new... it the day after I texted it? Three days later. Three days later? Yeah. Sorry, I was too busy being in Dubai. All right. <laughs> Mr. Holiday. In. Yep. <laughs> Mr. Holiday. Holiday in. in. <laughs> Holiday All in. right. Tired now. It's been, a, it's been a, oh my god. I'm we are getting towards the end, but I've enjoyed this so much. Um, I have <laughs> just had I have had a god awful day. You have actually, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, it has been it was hit and miss whether or not I was actually going to be here. And to be honest, I don't know if anybody's really that fussed. Imagine, way. right? This show with just me and Phil, it'll be freaking no, it'll be fucking dreadful. You six now, yeah, you'd have had to have drafted in someone urgent you'd have had to have probably got jack or someone to fill in just these two here you needed yeah. a you needed another I don't think a, we would another have gone anywhere another resident nintendo fanboy we would have just been arguing the yeah. entire way 
All the way. You don't see the entire podcast. I've not looked at him. I haven't looked at you the entire time, and I can't look at him. I can't look at Phil because there's something hypnotic about his eyes. It, that's what it is. It's the beard. Oh god, it is just like that. Oh, it's sharp. What was that that came off? It was beard hair. Brilliant. <laughs> is that you? <laughs> Terrifying. Just you look into his eyes, and it's just like he looks through you. There's there's something going on, isn't there? There's something. You see that episode of Doctor Who um, when uh, who's um, David? When David Tennant's Doctor goes at eleventh. 11th when he's going it, the the pit one when he meets like Brad, the devil satan. yeah the satan pit yeah. it's kind of like that there's a scene when like the satan head kind of rises up and just stares at um st- oh, uh, yeah. stares at what's it, david tennant <laughs> it's kind of like that phil's just kind of like this ominous presence with his ominous presence it's because i think the epitome of a bad guy is slick back hair yeah he's got that kind of devil's advocate al pacino thing kind of going on yeah he does and we're both okay and we're both keanu reeves you all play rough i can't i don't know anyone else okay using that. okay twinkle toes <laughs> something like that okay i'm reloading oh, you're <laughs> i don't know why you're turning that voice <laughs> <laughs> is that um scarface yeah world, yeah. Is, world is yours or whatever it's called i played that i completed I that, that one. it's a sequel like to the scarface, you? what you don't like scarface scarf ace yeah, I'd like Scarface. really good with things oh, that thing wrap around your neck keep you warm. I lie to you all the time, Phil, just to see what happens. I'll say... Trust I, this man. I lie to him, How and then, you like... trust him when he says things like... Whoopsie! Quick, <laughs> there you go! It's just lies. Yeah. I do, no, I actually... I'm never going to believe you again. Good, because that's kind of been what I've been building on for the last couple of years. Cool. The amount of lies I've given Shut you, up. and then I'll just look Shut away, up. and then he'll be like, he'll read it out to someone else, saying, oh, yeah, this has happened, and I'm like... No. That didn't happen. <laughs> Things you told me where you, you got like given. I loved you. That was during. I think this is the end. No, no, it's not. We haven't done number one yet. We haven't done number one. No, I meant oh. of the uh, actual us doing the podcast. I oh. think we've just <laughs> got to the point where we've just fallen out to a degree where we can't be in the same room together. Of course you can. Hey, Anne. Hey, Phil. You're beautiful. I know you are. What? Okay, <laughs> number one. <laughs> said I know you are to when he said I was beautiful I just realised number what he just one <laughs> number one yeah, I wonder if it's Mario no I don't think it is good call cool. Mario 64 for the Nintendo 64 it's when you said pilot because I was up here it's yeah it's um, and I picked 20 years ago charts because it's 20 years ago that the Nintendo 64 launched in the UK ah oh. how many units did it sell I only have the software charts. I didn't get the. I don't think hardware charts existed back then. So I More think it's, than the Wii U. <laughs> More than the Wii U, yeah, definitely. That was three. <gasps> oh, right? we missed number three. What's number three? Shadows of the Empire. Star Wars games. How did you miss oh, the yeah. Star Wars game? Well, I was too. Bi- I was three? distracted by, by you, idiot. Still's beard. Yeah. Stop staring at my beard. You can't help it. There's bits of food in it. That's for later, obviously. It's key, that's, I want that's some five keys. guys for later. I was just oh. making sure if you did send me a happy birthday, you know. I did. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I know you did. Oh, I did. You could so, have, I was bluffing now. Yeah. You didn't know. You didn't, you didn't mean the happy, though, did you? I think quick sound effects roulette to round off the... Uh, Go on, Phil. Off. You want me to start? You've got five more things first. Because I don't have any. Okay, let me just turn my data on. The creator of sound effects roulette doesn't have anything. You've been busy. You've been uh, on holiday. You've been sunning yourself. Have I? Look at this. This is me sunning up. I've got no tan. You've okay. got more tan than I, and I was away. Yeah, but I haven't really washed, so... <laughs> don't know how loud this is. <laughs> Does that count? <laughs> I haven't really washed. <laughs> okay, right. Are we going first, or are you going first? I, are you ready? Yeah. Go on, then. Hmm. Ah, oh, um... Go again? Yeah, go on. Okay. I think I've got a... Uh, is it Pac-Man? No. And again? Yeah, I thought it was... Space Invaders? And again? I'll play another one. From the same game? Yep. Go on then. You should get it from this. 
Oh, um, Frogger? Nope. Uh, let's do this one. Okay, that was terrible. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, I got it. Oh. Right, ready? Is it Pong or what's no. that? Hang on. Do that again. I can play all of them at the same time. Ah, uh, no, I'm And again? Anyone? Really familiar. Huh? It's... Yes. Oh, oh hey, nice one. <laughs> I thought I recognised it. Well done, Phil. Right, I'll go... Uh, all of mine are um, from uh, films. And I think I've just... I was thinking movie. Were they film quotes? No, they're films... With games based on films. Oh. So, uh, let me... Oh, what well, this actual show is based on, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> right, hang on. Oh, my phone's going. Here we go. Okay. Oh, we talked that, about this one before. That sounds. Uh, We've talked about this before. We? we might have done. Yeah. Is it Ghostbusters? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Is it Moonwalk? No. Um. Is it the Moonwalker thing? <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. I had that. Yeah, game. you both had it. Well done, guys. <laughs> I'll see you later. I got another one. Go on, Phil. Cheers. That's the noise. <laughs> uh, Tap <Tapper. gasps> <gasps> Nope. No. Wow, you are taking it old school with these. I am. Well, I, mean, I don't know how long this is. <laughs> That's what she's. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty short. Yeah. Let's play them all. Oh, no, no, I have no idea. Anyone? Joust. Oh, Joust. That's old. That is taking it. That's an old school it's reference like as well, because that was like the first ever episode we recorded. Yep. Okay. There, it's, uh, this one should be pretty easy. I don't know. What, what is Jack that? Over in the what corner. is that, Ant? Like, Can you see my mouth? <laughs> what is that? Okay, Ant? we'll do. What weapon is that, Ant? That's a silenced PP7. <laughs> okay. This one, this one I think only Ant will get. Oh, yeah. Who's your daddy? <laughs> Let's play that again. Oh, yeah. Who's your daddy? Oh, yeah, I know that one. That's uh, an Evil Dead game, isn't it? It is. Which one? Fist for the Boomstick? Nope. Based on a... Uh, oh, is it based on the movie? Based on the film. Evil Dead 2. Hail oh, yeah. to the King. Who's your daddy? Hail to the King. Yeah. The legend that is Bruce the, Campbell. One of the most hardest games I've ever played in my life. Yeah, yeah. Phil, your turn. I haven't got any more. Oh, you yeah, haven't got any more. Okay. No, I'll probably find some. Uh, this one is the last sound effect. The rest I have is music. Remember, these are based on films. Which Jurassic Park game was that? <laughs> no. 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 Which Jurassic Park game is that? <laughs> I'll I'll give you a quote. I'll play the sound effect one more time, and then I'll give you the give you a quote, and you might get it from the quote. The quote's not in the game, but the quote's from the film it's based oh, on. Is it what, uh, Alien Trilogy? No. Uh. It, and if I was to say it's working, it's working. It's working. It's working. It's one of my favourite sound effects from the game. Nope. It was, that was the sound when you boost in episode one, Pod Racer. Of course it is. 
God damn it, Saboba. Mm. I got one. Only because I've been playing it the other day. What have I got? That's not oh, even that loud. Crash Bandicoot. Yeah. Hey. Nice easy one. <laughs> okay. Name. Uh, these are music themes um, from games based on films. When it loads. Any minute now. Nope. Any minute. Almost there. Nearly there. I think same composer. Is it built? No. It sounds like either Men in Black or Beetlejuice. No. If you were playing the tutorial for this game, you would have heard the dulcet tones of Bruce Campbell. Oh, Spider-Man. Which two. One? Spider-Man 2. That's a great game. Okay. And... Which Jurassic Park game is this? Exactly, that's the question you should be asking yourself. Yeah. You can kind of guess it from the sound chip. Is it Lost World? No. It's the first one on Mega Drive. Should we do one more? And I think everyone will get this one. Aladdin <laughs> Aladdin in the crowd it Was on the Mega Drive this, this, That song was not No, on. no, this is Oh, this now one. it is Yeah Yeah There you go I didn't actually realise The difference between um, Aladdin on the SNES And Aladdin on the Mega Drive Was so great Because Yeah The Mega Drive one You literally played one stage Of a particular themed area and then moved on. Mm-hmm. But the SNES one, you had like three stages and a boss. So the boss. opening... A boss. Like a boss. Like a boss. Completed the land like a boss. M- boss. Boss. No, it can't be. Metal Gear. The whole thing stank. But I don't um, know it's been on the cold too long. <laughs> Behind D. <laughs> <laughs> I can't hold that. <coughs> um... Uh, so yeah like you would play three levels so the opening one is the like the Agrahabra market that's Japan isn't it Akahabra the <laughs> Abracadabra Alakazam there it is um, <laughs> oh. um, yeah so you had the three stages and then the boss and then you moved on to the desert level but the Mega Drive one one level of the marketplace and then like a bonus stage and then on to I never realised that until playing them previously, uh, playing them this week, in fact. I never played the SNES version, but I did play, well, I completed the Mega Drive version last year, again for the first time for a while. So vastly different. Mm. Quite a surprise. There you go. On that bombshell, I think, I think that's it. Is it over? I think we're literally in the dying embers of the, uh, of the show. Of ourselves. I think Alan's just taken a seat next to us. This is basically his way of saying, shoo us away. He's just ready to do stuff. On it He's just ready to do stuff. Okay, well then let's carry on, gents. Let's keep on going for another... Let's keep on going, shall How we? many more hours left until the end of the podcast event? Uh, 24? Tw- yeah, 20, 23. 23. We'll go for another 24 hours, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's keep going, work. right. We're fine, we'll do it. Oh, somebody get a cup here. of coffee. It's for charity, isn't it? I got work. <laughs> have you? Yeah, I can't. <laughs> I'll start walking. You just don't have the same commitment as us, do you? Nope. Phil... Let's we bring back this old segment quick whilst we've still got some time. Monkey Man News. I've got to do this, have I? Yeah. Right. Phil. Come on, Phil. And do the jingle. Oh, what was it? Oh, it was, it was, it was, it was like scat jazz. Monkey Man like, News. Ba, 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 ah, Monkey Man News. Nice. It was different every time, wasn't it? Great. Thank yeah, you. It was. It was it, that, that's what we loved about it. Yeah. What's the Monkey Man News, <laughs> Phil? 
Apparently, uh, a father in Nan- Indianapolis is under arrest after having his two children, after after his two children were found in the street, while he was inside their apartment playing a computer game. A woman named the Hell knows, no- not me, no me, no me, spot the children and some uh, summoned the police. When mm, no no me no me drove no, no into me. the apartment complex, she said. T- the naked two-year-old girl was standing just around a small bend where she could have been hit. Nomi stopped her car to tend to the girl and then noticed another one, one-year-old one boy was playing in the grass near the curb where only wearing only a small diaper. Of course, you want to get a Pokemon, any Grass Pokemon? <laughs> Bulbasaur was over there? Yeah. Uh, when the officers arrived, they found an open door several apartments down. Despite yelling through the open door and knocking several times, nobody answered. The officers then walked inside and up the stairs before finding a 31-year-old Timothy Hausman, mm. who was supposed to be watching his two children. Then he didn't, though he didn't initially respond. Officers said Hausman wasn't sleeping. He was actually on his bed playing an online role-playing game called Atlantis on his laptop. He said he had left his kids downstairs to play and he was so into his game that he had no idea they'd gone outside. <laughs> You've done that before, haven't you, Ant? What? <laughs> you left well, your kids outside when you were playing a game. Oh, my pictures of children? Yeah. <laughs> yes, they, absolutely I did that. Yeah. Were, they kisses, were they named Kisses and Cuddles? Yeah. <laughs> they got run over, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, well... I don't know about kisses, but no, Cuddles uh, died in her sleep. Oh, oh, right. Was that the one that died in their sleep above the radiator? Or was that someone else's cat? Above the radiator? Was that Ryan's cat? Oh, uh, yeah, and I think then because it was above the radiator, the smell. Yeah, yeah. Oh. It got really warm. Yeah. Yeah. That was it. Oh, you're talking about my snake that died after it got crushed. And then that smell. Something died my radiator. I just remember that story. And it smelled bad. Was did it die because he was p- busy playing computer games? Yeah, I'm guessing. Nah. But that's that's crazy <laughs> for to like. I mean, I have played games whilst Zachary has been in the house, but never to the point that he's wandered off and he's out and up the up the street. Never. I mean, I mean, I fall asleep looking after my niece once, who was like one. Did she leave the house? She left quite a distance of... Really? Well, not the house, but, like, she went downstairs. Oh, oh, what, in the same building, though? Did she fall yeah. down the stairs? I don't know, I was asleep. <laughs> <laughs> was she crying when you woke up? I don't know, she was asleep. <laughs> she was asleep. <laughs> she was asleep. <laughs> she was asleep. <laughs> Did you have to go to hospital with her? She was in the next no. door's dog like, kennel. No. Dog kennel. <laughs> Locked. Yep. <laughs> Why was it? How was it locked? Someone locked her in. She there. picked the lock. Oh, Phil! Well, I kind of know where you're going with that. One. <laughs> I wasn't going anywhere. But where was I going? No, I'm not saying because it would cost me money. <laughs> yeah, we've confused. Just say it. Yeah, it's all gone. I'm it's gone. all gone. Pete Tong now. What? What? Oh, what? I thought he was going. Who's that? Anthony? What's his face? Jessel Nick. Jessel Nick. Yeah, I thought he was oh. going in that direction with oh, that no, joke. I wasn't. You know, I love that guy. Yeah. But if anybody wants to know what that joke refers to, please tweet at Monkey Man Phil and he will happily tell you. Or uh, Anton Bain. <laughs> One of those two. I'm not a big fan of. Is it Anthony, Anthony Jesselnik? Anthony yeah, yeah. Jesselnik. Yeah, I don't think he's very funny. Oh, he's hilarious. The other day I hit a kid with my car. It wasn't serious. Nobody saw me. That's the kind of dry joke yeah, he has. Yeah, I don't think I don't think he's very funny. Do you know it's Red Nose Day? It is Red Nose Day, and it's all about so children. It's it is. So let's <laughs> cheer things up <laughs> at the end, and let's just gloss over. Did you actually hit that kid? No. Okay, let's write them. It's a fictitious child. Don't worry, children. Is don't worry. Right. On that note, I can only apologise to all of our listeners. I think Sorry, John. Zero, don't worry. Sorry, John. <laughs> Sorry, John. The one listener. Um, but no, I think that I think that's it. I think thank, we're you, over. thank you um, for listening. Thank you for you are, joining me, Ant. That's all right. It's Phil, no as ever. Yeah, thank you, Phil, for being involved. Thank you. Um, yeah. So you've been listening to. Oh, um, it's good. Were you slick? Muscle, it's, it's, mussing up it's, his hair. It's really thick. Like it's just stuck. It is. There. It's like it's, his beard. It's almost yeah. not real, is it? 
<laughs> Nothing like he's me, kind really. of. It just I, I look at it and I have to move from around because every time I think it's looking at me, it is. his eyes, the <laughs> beard. He's like cousin it on his head. <laughs> Cousin it. That's cousin it impression. Don't say it's not. <laughs> I've, I'm done arguing. I'm all <laughs> argued out now. Yeah. Dusty, there, there you go. go. Whatever the hell that was. Dusty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well done, Phil. Right, um, well, I've been Heist Definition. I've been Monkey Man Phil. Uh, I've been Heist <laughs> Definition. <laughs> it's all too confusing. Thank Can you for listening, do? folks. Continue listening. We have... Um, a Nintendo podcast system up next um, yeah we've been Vanderhoff and Co hope we've uh, yeah Just entertained you life. cheers then cheers then <laughs> I love cheers, that. Then. Also, cheers then cheers then yeah bye bye now yeah bye Thanks. yeah see ya have a good one enjoy your weekend I need to just play the theme don't forget to play write the theme soon play the theme soon Southampton Superpod. 36 hours of podcasts broadcast live from the Grand Harbour Hotel in Southampton.